To get started, I just added a clip to my timeline that I'd like to put some credits after. Let's begin by going over to the Titles panel. Click the Adobe Stock tab. Type Credits in the search box and press Enter. Drag one of the 10 named credit roll options after the last clip on your timeline. Now you can either attempt to sync the fonts that the template comes with, or you can just hit OK like me and use whatever default font you have to start with. Next, position the time head so that you can see the first few titles. Then go over to the Edit tab for your title. In here you'll see all the different titles that you can set up for your credits. To edit one, just select it to expand its option. Now just type to enter your desired text. If you want to edit these properties, reselect your text and then change what you'd like. I'm just going to change the font to Arial and tinker with its size. Keep selecting your titles and names and editing them to your liking until you're finished. But let's say you only have 7 credits that you want and not 10. Position the time end near the end of your clip so that you can see the credits you don't want. In the Edit tab, select each undesired credit and hit the Delete key on your keyboard to get rid of them. Okay, now I only have the credits I want. To change the speed of your credits roll, just drag the end of your clip to either shorten or extend them. Alright, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.